Heroku Pharmaceuticals is developing uh, a whole portfolio uh, of re-engineered NSAIDs using a technology that enables us to develop drug products that have much smaller particle sizes than your standard drug product. And this translates into more rapid dissolution and um, in our PK studies, um, we've been able to demonstrate that this results in more rapid absorption uh, of, our, of our drugs, which essentially allow you to treat people with lower doses of these agents. So this is a, these are the results of the phase three study um, in our uh, Solumatrix uh, indomethacin product. Uh, again, it's at a dose that's about 20% lower than the standard indomethacin immediate release dose. And in this study, we demonstrated um, significant uh, benefits in terms of analgesia in patients who had undergone bunionectomy surgery um, compared with placebo. In this particular study that we're presenting here, we're presenting the results of uh, the usage of rescue medication, which is additional analgesic agents that might re be required for patients who are really unable to tolerate just the standard um, study medication. And, and what we've demonstrated here is that significantly fewer patients um, who were treated with the cellular matrix and the um, utilized rescue medication. Um, we also found that um, in terms of the numbers of tablets or in the numbers of doses, there were significantly fewer um, doses of the rescue medication used by the cellular matrix and the group um, compared with placebo. And not surprisingly, what we saw is that the time before patients needed rescue medication was significantly delayed um, for the solumetrics and the medicine group compared to placebo. So basically, you know, o overall what these results do is support the results from our initial primary efficacy analysis um, of these data. Um, but I think what they also do is highlight the fact that, you know, there may be some, some, some benefits here as well um, in terms of considering solute matrix indomethacin as another option um, instead of um, opioid-containing uh, analgesia, you know, for, for appropriate patients.